I spoke to a young sister in her 20s the other day, a Muslim sister. And she says, Imam Siraj, I, a couple years ago, I was in an um, abortion clinic. And I met another Muslim sister there. And you know what I found out? Any imam will tell you that whatever problems we're having in the dunya, we're having the same problems in the Muslim community. How many of you know a Muslim girl who has had a baby without being married? Raise your hand. Look, raise your hand. Hi. How many of you know Put them down, put them down, put them down. How many, put, a hand, put your hand down. How many of you know a Muslim brother or sister who's on drugs? Raise your hand. Put your hands down. How many of you know a Muslim who have AIDS? Raise your hand. Look around. Why is it that everything that happens in the dunya is also happening in the masjid? How many of you know a Muslim who used to practice and no longer practices Islam? Raise your hand. Next year, at the camp, will somebody be raising their hand talking about you? Next year at the camp, when they ask how many young Muslim sisters got pregnant, will they be talking about you? Next year at the camp, when they ask the question, how many Muslim brothers on drugs, how many Muslim brothers in prison, will they be talking about you? So brothers and sisters tonight, I simply want to ask you to make a decision that you want to be Muslim.